did, that did something. Alright, let's try the next one. Uh, okay, that one's not there. Okay, not, not, not that one. Uh, I've done that one already, so let's go back to this one. Critical boost. helps. Blow blast canister. Wait, what does that do? Can I can I blow up with glow blast canister? Oh, chain reaction. Ah, uh, spit. Can I actually see that? Side of shit. Ah. Always, they always fall on the wrong fucking side, don't they? He knows it. He knows it. He fucking knows it. Fucking scripted nonsense. Fucking knew he was going to go for this fucking glow blaster canister. Absolute bullshit. Fucking bullshit. Fuck off. Fucking bullshit, you fucking piece of shit. Right, let's just do this shit again. Fucking waste of time that was, isn't it? Absolute fucking waste of time that was, you fucking shit. This is fucking boring.
fucking ammo, is she? Wrong arrows. Oh my god, fucker! What's better. this bullshit, man? Fuck off! Oh my god, how the fuck did he get over there so. Oh, this is, this is getting started to piss me off this game. Is. Cheating game. Fuck off. Fucking cheating bullshit game. It's so annoying this game. Isn't it? So fucking annoying. Look at that bullshit blind fucking shit again. Ugh! I'm waste my fucking time in this fucking nonsense. So bullshit that is. Absolutely fucking bullshit.
Hey, the big! The big fucking go for the fucking wall! Fucking cheating game. Take off. Oh my god, come on! Oh my god, what is this nonsense? Where are these fuckers coming from? Where are you going?
Right, let's try um, next skill, next thing. Uh, it's not gonna work. Many might know. Nah. I try acid. Let's try something else. big
Ah, oh, you bastard. I'm dead now, you fuck, fuck face. Right, that's the fucking part I need. Okay, good. No! No, you bastard, you fucking piece of shit! You fucking cunt game! Just waste of fucking time! What a waste of fucking time that was! What a fucking waste of fucking time! You fucking piece of shit game! What a waste of fucking time that was! Completely fucking waste of time. Huh? Completely wasted my time that was. Completely fucking waste of fucking time that was. It's a waste of fucking time. Fucking bullshit. Absolutely fucking bullshit. Of course you didn't get the fucking primary nerve. Fucking nonsense. Absolutely fucking waste of fucking time that was. God, of course, 62%. You fucking joke. Fucking waste of fucking time. Complete waste of fucking time. Bullshit. Let's see if those those parts are not gonna have it. Wait, did, did wait, wait, did she um? Wait, where's that? Did, wait, did she tear off the ammo part, ammo drum? I know the ammo drum doesn't doesn't have it, but. Let's get some fucking resources from it. These fucking shitheads. Right, good job. Uh, 
close now. Frost will hurt it. Right, um... Uh, I don't know if it was worth it. Can I climb up there? Yeah, it's been a while since I've seen any rebels. Yeah. It, it, it looks like they've uh, regarded as definitely not sent any rebels out any, anymore.
Safety's on me. Okay, um... Wait, do I need anything do I need from these guys? I need something, do I need something with long legs? Longer primary nerves. You're gonna fuck off, damn it. I don't have any rocks. Okay, this might work. Should use shock ammo. Good Please tell me you got the part that I need. 
Or it was another waste of time. Of course you didn't get it. That's a fucking waste of time. Ugh. God. Ugh. Fucking hell. It's a waste of time. Top. <laughs> near, near, near the base. Change outfits. Stay alert, soldier. Okay. Right. So she can put on this um uh infiltrator hard weave. Now she only has one. <laughs> Let's do Silent Strike Heal and let's do Silent Strike Health Tear. Okay, um, right. You shouldn't miss this chance I've got to nothing trade. To report. Okay. What, what do you have? Anything new? No. Okay, I'm gonna sell that. Okay. All right, thanks. Maybe in tomorrow's stream, the um, what have issues with the um, FPS? Yeah, that's the stuff.
Alright, it's just going to, it's going to save. Hopefully the game won't crash. Okay, the FPS looks fine here, so it's, it's, it's fine here. It's good. Alright, let's do a quick save and let's do a manual save. Go Let's go and check a few things first before I uh anything new here? Still not working. Hey, how's it going? Anything new? Hey, Loy. Well met. We've been briefed on our mission and are ready whenever you wish to head to Cauldron Gemini. Were you able to finish the new arm Gaia was helping you with? Indeed. I was hoping we could discuss it, if you have a moment. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. How are your studies going? I wanted to learn more about the world of the Old Ones. And? I looked up this pharaoh Gaia said you went looking for, and learned about the plague of machines he unleashed. To think that the ancient world was wiped out by... <laughs> a mistake. A single miscalculation that... There is no glory or honor in such a fate. Only hubris. And pointless death. That about sums it up. Mm. Have you spoken with Alva? The Quen is peculiar. Nothing like a Tanakh. Her mind is sharp, that much is certain. But it's hard to imagine her surviving in the wilds. Trust me, she's tougher than she looks. I will take your word for it. Hmm. You wanted to talk about your arm? Indeed. It's time to test it. And I want you to be there. Okay. How are we doing this? Not how. Where. Will you meet me where we felled Regala's tremor tusk? Right where the river bends? Sure, if you want, but I'm not sure I understand. You'll see when we get there. I promise. Then I'll let you know when I get close. You have my thanks, Aloy. Okay. Farewell. I have to go now. Then do not let me keep you. Like I said, I'll call you when I'm close to Regala's old outpost near the bulwark. May the Ten guide your way. Isn't that oh, it's quite just quite far, isn't it? Okay, at least that at least that that okay, at least that quest is um Wait. Wait, hold on. Let me Where was this? Okay, yeah, it is. Yeah. That is. That's. Well, yeah. To the bulwark. Okay. That is a trick. Hmm. 
else. Yeah, I, th I think I, sh I think I should. Hmm. Yeah, I think I should. There's Gwen stuff in here now. Must be all of us. Common language. Okay. Ever since the exhibition landed and encountered barbarians, sorry, uh, the next. The question has been gnawing at me. Given the massive distance between here and Great Delta, how is it possible that we all speak the same language? I mean, the legacy tells us that the ancestors had many languages. How did it all get reduced to one? For questions like these, it's handy to have a friendly, super intelligent around. I love Gaia. He's so nice and patient. Even when I can't stop talking and bombard her with overlapping queries. Well, I she can't explain everything. Ask her for this one. He had the answer. Apparently, the Zero Dawn system was designed to release people into the world as young adults after being educated as via the Apollo database. I sure wish I could have gone to that school. Language production was supposed to be a big part of the coursework. Students were to be encouraged to learn many languages, thus keeping alive the vibrant, the vibrant linguistics of the old world. But when Ted Farrow Raise Polo, he make Raise Polo. He makes me so mad. Zero Dawn reverted to the default language, and that's what kids in the cradle because they ever got. So, ancestors, I mean, are tribal ones, not the legacy ones, all stuck with the same speech and never got to learn anymore. Yeah, Richard's response. Yeah, yeah, another rotten, completely unfair thing that she had. Big my pilot did to the world. Hmm. Yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense that uh, 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 Pharaoh is a shithead. So the old ones liked painting tiny soldiers? Alva, you're here. How's it going? Aloy, right to work, I see. There's just so much. I mean, we knew of artificial beings that served the ancestors, but Gaia? Oh, she's amazing! A and you, a true reincarnation of an ancestor. Genetically speaking, of course, not like the, um, late CEO. And there's more ancestors out there, returned from beyond the stars. Uh, of course, they're trying to kill us, which is not great. And Eric Visser is with them, which is disturbing. And then there's Hephaestus, and... Okay, okay. How about we take it one step at a time? You're right. I also owe you an explanation for everything that happened at Landfall. Yeah. Yeah, let's talk about the Queen. You said you owed me an explanation for what happened in Thebes. I'm listening. Right. I'll start at the beginning with the CEO. He was an Imperial, the Emperor's nephew, in fact. 
As such, he sponsored many diviners to search the legacy for anything that might help the tribe, and himself. He took a special interest in anything related to Ted Farrow, whom we consider the greatest of the ancestors. Ted Farrow, revered ancestor. That's tough to take. I know better now, of course. Anyway, the Diviners discovered that Pharaoh spent a great deal of time in San Francisco. In fact, many of the most important ancestors did. So the Emperor's nephew convinced him that an expedition across the ocean might solve our most pressing problems. If only we could find the right data in this fabled city. Perhaps we could roll back the floods and storms that threatened our people. The Emperor declared that all the tribe's resources be poured into this endeavor. Dozens of ships were built, scouting missions were dispatched, and the Emperor's nephew was named Sio, one who wields the legacy for the good of the Empire. The living embodiment of Ted Farrow, a renewer. It may seem strange now, but for a time, he carried all of our hopes. We really believed he would save us. We had no idea just how perilous the journey would be. Uh... You said the expedition across the sea was more dangerous than you thought it would be. What happened? We lost most of our ships to hurricanes, and scores of soldiers perished to hunger and disease. And that was before we even hit the coast. Once we landed, machines ripped our patrols apart, and we struggled to replenish our rations. There were bright spots, to be sure. We found Thebes and the greenhouse, but nothing improved the CEO's mood as his dreams of saving the tribe were slowly dashed. He became more and more obsessed with Thebes and what lay behind its door, and more and more convinced that the title of CEO was no mere honorific. You heard him spouting nonsense about Pharaoh's essence and some kind of becoming. We knew these weren't the words of a sane man, but he was quick to put any who spoke out in front of a firing squad. What a great guy. The Quen are wrong about many things when it comes to the legacy. I can see that now. But what the CO became was a complete perversion of what principal diviners stand for. The pursuit of truth. Uh... I'm sorry you had to endure his madness. I'm just glad it's over. For everyone. So, Bohai, your overseer, will he run things better than Sio? He won't execute people on a whim, if that's what you mean. But he's hardly a paragon of integrity. I can't tell you how many times he took credit for data in the legacy that I uncovered. The best thing I can say about him is that he can be trusted to always do what's best for him. Yep, sounds about right. Mm. The Ancestors, is that what your people call the Old Ones? Yes and no. The Ancestors are the greatest of the Old Ones. Those whose legacy taught us agriculture, medicine, Warfare, leadership, and patronage of the science and arts. The CEO called Elizabeth Sobek an assistant. What's that about? Right. Well, any old one who has made minor contributions or worked extensively under one of the ancestors is called an assistant. That's how we thought of Sobek. Until we met you. Our limited access to data past the late 2040s has obviously uh, misinformed our view of the past. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Back at the greenhouse, you spoke of knowledge forbidden to your people. Diviners are meant to seek out the truth in the legacy. And many Imperials sponsor them in the hopes they'll find something the Empire can put to use, thus gaining favor with the Emperor. But the Board of Overseers claims certain truths are detrimental to the stability of the Empire. Like discovering one of our revered ancestors ended the world. That is why diviners are only allowed to access segments of the legacy. Only overseers can view it all. It ensures that any heretical data can be contained and retrieved before it can spread. What happens to diviners who break the rules? 
I never had the courage to ask. Hmm. Okay. 